Okay, today is Tuesday, and it is my day off. So, just took Ethan to his speech therapy, and we just got a little treat from Jack in the Box. It's only, it's like within the same parking lot, but there's like a lot of cars out today. Like, I think everyone's out, like, spending tax money, because it's like oddly busy outside for a freaking Tuesday. So, I don't know. And if you're like, dang, Hannah looks kind of like she's burning up. Um, uh, kind of, it's kind of humid, hot today, and I don't have any makeup on because I'm giving my skin... A little bit of a break because as you know I have to wear makeup every day to work not that I mind it's the job I love it but my skin doesn't always love it let's get parked okay so I got parked I don't know why that was so crazy but there was like a thousand people within one parking lot I don't know anyway so, because Ethan and I already ate lunch today, and technically I've already eaten dessert, but it's my day off, so I'm going to eat and drink what I want. So, yeah. Anyway, so I got a Jack in the Box iced coffee caramel. I can't remember if I've ever had one of these from Jack in the Box. So good. Uh, Y'all are going to come at me, but better than Starbucks. And I love Starbucks. Don't get me wrong. But I love Starbucks. But that right there, that last coffee right there, that's hidden. That's good. And then I got this chocolate overload cake, but I don't know if I'm going to drink drink it. I don't know if I'm going to eat it right now. I don't think I'm going to save it for later because this drink is pretty sweet. But yeah. Maybe in a minute. I don't know. But yeah. So like while we're sitting here waiting on Ethan uh, to get done with his appointment let's do a little catch up and laugh. Um, first let me roll this window. Do y'all hear all the cars go by? Maybe that'll help. But, okay, so, like, I just want to toot my own horn a little bit because I've actually been really proud of myself. And, whoops. And I am not always proud of myself. I don't, a lot of times I feel like I'm not doing enough to even be proud about anything, but... That's clearly not the case. But anyway, um, that's just my mind going to dark, deep places it doesn't need to go. But ever since I started my new job at Ulta, have I been exhausted? Absolutely, because it's really, like, changed my whole life schedule. But, like, in a good way. I feel like old Hannah, like when old Hannah used to work full time in the salon, um, I feel that way again. And what I mean by that is I feel like free, not that I wasn't free before, but like, I don't know, I just feel like a huge weight has been lifted off my shoulders since getting a job. And I don't know, I like it. Like I like it a lot. Does it have its like times I'm like, eh? Of course, because I'm a human and it's a job, so. And I work with all kinds of different people, like, employee-wise, yes, but, like, customers and clients. Some days I'm like, ah, but most of the time it's really great. So, if you happen to watch this and you come into Ulta and I assist you, do anything for you, and... 
I appreciate it and I love it and come back <laughs> and if for some reason I didn't make you happy well sorry about that too because for some reason I've had a lot of, not a lot I take that back just a few sour apples this past work week and um, I'm just going to say they were having bad days and chose to take it out on me so what can you do? But yeah, I'm just really proud of myself because I've had to relearn it, relearn how to manage all of my time. Whereas before, yes, I was managing my time, but it wasn't as, you know, crucial as it is now. Like, literally, I have to use every free moment very wisely because I do work quite often. But I don't know, but I love it. And who doesn't love making extra money? <laughs> so that has also helped a lot because me and Ethan are able to do a little bit more because we have a little extra. So, yeah. So that's that. Like, I really love my job. I think I'm like a month in now. Yeah, something like that. And I love it. I don't plan on going anywhere. So I'll be there. Hopefully until I decide to not work anymore at a place of business. So, anyway. So, that's what's really been taking up most of my time is working. And trying to fit in all these free moments with Ethan as much as I can. Because I do miss him during the day while I'm gone. And I know, like, he kind of he kinda gets a little upset sometimes. But... You know, it's normal. Like, he's had me at home forever for, like, the last 10 years. So, you know. But he's adjusting well, so it's all good. And he's never, like, alone. So, that's good. But, yeah, so we've been doing really great. And, I don't know. Like, I've got a few projects on hold right now just because, like I said, my time is very much occupied with this new job, but I do plan on starting those projects back up soon, sooner than later. It's warming up outside, and when it's warm outside, that is my season, so I'll be able to comfortably be outside to do these projects because they require being outside, but anyway. But thank God for spring, for real though, because I am tired of cold weather. I was so sick of it. It still gets kind of cold sometimes, but not like it was. And that's fine with me because I love the warmth. Like by like end of July, August, it's like super hot, but I still like it because it's you can do a lot more outside stuff. So yeah. So we have that, and like I said, this is just my day off. No makeup today. I love makeup. I love all types of makeup. Woo, but baby, you gotta give your skin a break sometimes. Like, my skin is also adjusting to me wearing makeup every day. So, it's a little scary. But it's okay. It'll be fun. Bam. So anyway, today, I guess when Ethan gets done, we're going to go. We got to wash some laundry just a little bit. And I think we're going to go to the mall and just kind of window shop. But I really need to go to Target because, like, the shower thing and the shower that holds, like, all your shampoo and stuff, you know? Like, uh, we had one that, like, hangs, like, on the shower head and whatnot. And one of the shelves broke on it the other day. So, I need to replace it. Thinking, like, one of the, to get one of those ones you put in the corner of the shower. Surely it'll work. The only thing is, like, the shower is really tall, so... 
I gotta figure that out. But maybe we'll go to Target. I know Ethan wanted to go to the mall, but maybe I can persuade him to go to Target. I'll get him a Starbucks. <laughs> And then I'm just going to go home and chill out. Thankfully, I'm also off tomorrow. I'm usually off on Thursdays. Which is always nice because it's like the day before like my five days of work. But that's alright. I'm off tomorrow, which is on Wednesday. So tomorrow, I think we're going to probably like go on a walk or something because it's supposed to be pretty nice outside like today and I need to like deep clean my house I was gonna do it today but we had stuff to do so that just that ain't gonna be it we'll do it tomorrow but yeah that was really weird a fire truck just had their lights on and then they turned them off. Mm. So, yeah. Yeah, and then also, like, we're trying, um, trying to find, like, a new house. And the process, even the beginning process, is stressing me out a little bit. Like, Buying a home is like signing your life away, which I've learned. So, I gotta make sure it's exactly what I want forever and ever because... <laughs> yeah, I don't want to ever have to go through this process again. So, hopefully we can find something within like the year. You know? Maybe? <sighs> We just got to get out of the neighborhood we're currently in. Like, it's okay. But we live right next to a train track. Kind of, and it's really loud and annoying. Ethan hates it. I hate hearing about it. Com him complain about it all the time. And plus, the neighborhood is starting to get a little sketch. For whatever reason. I don't know. So... Pray for us on that, because we need a new house, but, uh, definitely going to buy, not rent anymore, because I have to purchase a home for Ethan, so, no more renting, I got to look to buy, so, uh, wish me luck on this stressful adventure, so, anyway, but yeah, so I'm just going to chill, Wait till Ethan gets out, and then we're gonna go finish our day. So, anyway, y'all have a great rest of your day, and I'll see you next time. Bye.